Jesse, there's a game come up on Saturday. Very strange preparation, but outside of the office, what's it like inside? Uh, no, it's been it's been really good. Uh, it's been business as usual for us in here, but you know it is a different sort of sort of week, different sort of times at the moment, and uh, you know it's pretty crazy what's going on. But we're just trying to uh, really focus in on this week's game. Uh, you know it is quite hard to do that, but I think we're doing a good job at um, you know trying to focus in on what what's ahead of us. As one of the guys in the leadership group, does that put a little bit on you to make sure the young guys are, are up and about and ready for this sort of action? Yeah, I think so. Um, you know, it's important for us as leaders to filter through what the doctor's telling us, and uh, it's important for us as well. You know, when we're at training, we're training, and uh, you know, outside of training, when guys want to talk and uh, you know they want us to, I guess, clarify things and and what's going on around the town, around the place. I think that's the time. So. Um, you know, it's very, very important for us as leaders to, to lead the way and I think the, the boys are doing that well. As it stands at the moment, we'll be going to the Sharks to play at Cogra on Saturday, going up and back in the one day. That in itself will be new. Yeah, it's a, it's a you know, crazy time. So I think that, um, you know, that's the best thing we can do at the moment. Um, I think the NRL are doing the best they can. So, so we have to do the best we can, you know, and uh, little things like, you know, staying staying on top of our hygiene and doing things like that. So, you know, I think it's a good good initiative. Um, it's the best thing we can do, and uh, we're all doing that. How does that affect your preparation, being on a plane in an afternoon when you're playing it that night? Oh, it's different. Um, you know, I haven't done that since I was an under twenty, so at least I've done that before. But I think it just changes the way. You know, eating times are different. Um, lots of guys like to nap and and do that kind of thing before the game. So that might be out the window. Um, you know, even just traveling on the day is, is different. I don't think any of the boys you know, in first grade anyway have uh, had much experience doing that. So it'd be new for us. Um, you just have to try and take everything in your stride at the moment and, and do the best you can, because uh, you know, that's what, what's called for at the moment. Speaking of your 20s days, you used to play in front of no crowds or a few people. It's going to be like that on Saturday as well. Yeah, it's going to be a weird one, that one. Um, you know, we love having the fans here and, you know, they, they really get you up and about. So um, it's going to be different. Um, everyone's on the same playing field, I guess. Um, you know, we really wish the fans could be there, but at this at this moment they can't. So we'll be still putting in our best effort. Um, you know, I'm sure Bellyache and the coaching staff will have the boys up ready to go. So, you know, we're looking forward to, to a good match against the Sharks and uh, hopefully we can put our best... Uh, fought forward and uh, yeah, do our best. On the Sharks, they put in a good performance against South, just fell short, but showed what their potential is. Yeah, you know, they're a really tough team. Uh, they've been a tough team for a long time. Uh, you know, they're really gritty, so uh, we'll be looking looking at some vision today on, you know, their key players. Um, you know, they've got a very strong forward pack, so it's, uh, you know, a big job for us to back up last week's performance and uh, put in a good one for the boys.